Hey guys, welcome back to Burns the Math Club. Today's topic is what are composite numbers. Now, in our previous video, we did talk about what are prime numbers. In this video, we will talk about numbers apart from the prime numbers, which are composite numbers. And a composite number is a number that has more than two factors. Let's get started. So let's take the number 12. To find the factors of this number, which is 12, we need to create a line. Now we need to add some floors. What we are going to be doing is we're going to be taking the number 12 from the top floor and we're going to bring it down to the smallest number form. Okay, but before we do anything, I would like you to put the number 1 automatically into the list because the number 1 uh, um, we, we cannot put into our um, factors since 1 times any number is that number. So every number for um, uh, uh, on in the numbers would be a factor of 1, right? So we cannot do that. So we have to start with the second number aside from 1, which is a number 2. So 2 times 6 is 12. Now we can break the number 6 further apart. 2 times 3 is 6. Now we can break the number 3 further apart. 3 times 1 is 3. See, now what I did was that I broke number 12 to the number 1, and the number 1 is the smallest form, so we cannot go further. Okay, so we have all the factors we needed, which are 2 and 3. Okay, and remember, you always have to put the number itself at the end, since um, the number 12 is a factor of 12. Okay, so now we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 factors of 12 so the number 12 is a composite number let's try another number for example so let's take the number 13 first we have to find the factors for this number so we'll create a line next we create some floors and we're going to be taking the number 13 all the way to the bottom floor okay so, before we do anything, again, remember, we have to add a 1 into our list automatically because 1 times any number is that number. So, we start from the other second number, which is the number 2. But wait, 2 cannot go into 13. Neither can the, any other number except 13 itself. So, 13 itself is the only number that can go into 13 1 times. So, 13 is the only factor we have. Now, if you look over here, we have two factors. So 13 is not a composite number since a composite number has more than two factors. So that's that for what are composite numbers. I hope you got all the main facts I want you to know in this video. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye.